Have you ever wondered what your ferret sees? Or what they don't see? Today, I'm going to answer just that. So while your ferrets are taking a break from stealing your stuff and rummaging through your bags, how do they see the world? So one of the first things we need to understand is that ferrets don't see that well far off. After about two feet, they don't really see that well. So everything else is gonna be a bit fuzzy. As Erica Matulit says, it is unlikely that ferrets can look up at you and see specific details of your face. They just know you have a face. So that kind of puts it into perspective just a little bit. Just a little bit. Now, if you've done any research on ferrets when their vision, you'll probably find a factoid that says ferrets can only see red and that everything else is just shades of gray or tones of gray. But that's not exactly the case. Some people have said they can see more than that, it's just the fact that their eyesight is so poor to begin with that it's not as prominent as the color red. Ferret's eyes have a reflective thingamabooper in them, and so occasionally you'll notice their eyes are glowing, which is rather interesting to see. But that also means is that they see best in Twilight. No, not the movie, and Team Jacob. This Jacob. Ferrets also have a blind spot right in front of their nose. Like humans, we can't exactly see what's right here, nor right here, and ferrets are the same. And so what they'll do is they'll sniff and occasionally lightly bite something just to see what it is. They're more reliant on their sense of smell, hearing, and other things than their sense of sight. Now where things get interesting is their eye placement. Now they're similar to rabbits in that their eyes are farther back on their heads than our human eyes. And the thing about rabbits is that they have a field of view that is nearly 360 degrees, which means they can almost see everything around them. If you've ever seen 360 video, it's pretty cool because you can see everything everything. Now for reference, we humans, we can see nearly 180 degrees. So I'm guessing that ferret vision is somewhere between 200 and 300 degrees, which is still pretty cool. Alright, so I'm going to give you some examples of field of view, which will kind of give you perspective. You've got your own field of view, which is 180 degrees, but that doesn't exactly put it in perspective in video form. So right now this camera is about 30-ish, probably 60 field of view, I can't tell off the top of my head. But I can tell you from my camera, my camera in its stationary mode is at 170 degrees. Now what you might notice is that there's a fisheye effect. The room is kind of bending towards the edges. Now I, our eyes do that too, except your brain compensates for this. Your brain makes it to where everything looks straight and also you can see all around you. You're not limited to one screen, which is why you're getting that effect. So say you had three monitors, this fisheye effect that you're currently seeing would not exist. On the subject of monitors and video games, come over to my Jakey Does Gaming channel and watch me play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. It's fairly interesting, and I think you might enjoy it. As always, thank you so much for watching the video. If you liked the video, please do like the video. And also, if you want to, please do share the video, as that does help out quite a bit as well. And also, it's awesome of you to share the video, because then your friends might share, and we get a chain reaction going, and yeah. <laughs> so, thank you guys again so much for watching the video. Please do check out my gaming channel, subscribe there, because I'm going to be doing a weekly video there. And as always, I hope you have a nice day.